with the new details. Good morning. The bill has changed significantly since it was first drafted and different from the one that passed the Senate. Now, it even caused some advocates and co-sponsors to drop their support for the bill. So here's how the Senate and House versions differ. In the Senate version, employers would be prohibited from paying employees differently for comparable work if the disparity in wages is based on race, color, religion, sexual orientation, gender identity or expression, disability or age or country of ancestral origin. In the House version, that language was changed to just equal work. It also said the bill only applies to businesses with 18 or more employees, and it also lowers the penalty for violating that law from $200 to $100. House Speaker Nicholas Mariello, though, calls the new version a great compromise. High tide lifts all boats, and that's what we've been working on, and this is a compromise that accomplishes just that. It guts uh, the original intent of the bill that was introduced um, and actually moves us backwards on some of the fair pay protections that we've had since the 50s here in Rhode Island. The bill ultimately passed 66 to 9, and it was sent to the Senate. We're told that the chamber will review it. If you want to check out more on this story, by the way, just click on this story on WPRI.com. For now, live at the State House, Alexander Leslie, Eyewitness News.